I enjoy every day of it, uh, and if you don't, I think you need to seriously consider what you're doing. Uh, if you don't enjoy getting up every day and doing it, then uh, what's the point? <laughs> Willie, I'm coming at you, man, and I hope you're ready. But I hope I will, uh, I will show a good fight. Okay, here we go from Holland, the street fighter, Willie Peters, 34 years old, from Arnhem, Holland. He's six feet tall, 205 pounds. Took this fight on a little bit of short notice, boss. Yes, he did. He had five days notice, so that's, that's character right there, you know. But he told me he's already been in training, and uh, so he expects to be fairly competitive. Nice it, tattoo there. It's very nice. It's a new one. I never saw it on him. And I saw many fights of him in Holland. He uh, actually was the cage champion in Holland, the Holland uh, cage fight champion. Yeah, he won the very first uh, eight-man cage fight uh, tournament in Holland. Um, and he beat a very tough Brazilian in the finals, Eduardo Roca, uh, by knockout. Uh, Willie told me that he's uh, won most of his fights by knockout. Yep. He's had 80 no-holds-barred fights and over 60 wins, mostly by knockout. He's a great striker. From the United States of America, Pete Hearing. And here he comes from the USA. Born in Waco, Texas. Grew up in Amarillo, Texas. Big Pete Herring. Also making his first appearance in Pride. He's six foot four inches tall, 265 pounds, currently residing in Holland also. Yep, he's training with Coral Hammer's uh, Mang Ho Gym. That's exactly the same gym where I started training. And uh, he came in a month ago, and I heard he already lost like uh, 20 pounds. So uh, he's in tip-top shape right now. Yeah, he's, he's down in weight for sure because he was up to somewhere around 280, 290 pounds previously. But he looks like a whole new man now. Uh, sporting uh, a real nice little dapper beard there, a little bit of hair. He usually shaves his head. There's Core Hammers there, right next to him. Yep. The legendary trainer of such luminary stars as Boss Group, my broadcast partner, and Ramon Decker, among many world champions. It's true, and he's hearing, I think he got his hair because he's in Holland. In Holland right now, it's really cold. Yeah. The match will consist of two 10-minute rounds. Willie Peters, gentleman from Holland, he's been there and done that, 80 no-holds-barred fights. Herring is a tremendous athlete, started his uh, no-holds-barred career at the age of 18 while he was playing high school football. Uh, the, he told me that the wrestling coach at his high school kept begging him to come down and try out, and he, he said he didn't want to wear the wrestling singlet, which is the outfit they wore, because he had a problem with it. But once he did go down and wrestle, he was hooked for life, he said. And here we go. Willie Peters versus Heath Herring. They come out jabbing. The nice front kick by Heath Herring. Willie jumps over the top, tries to throw a right hand. Willie throws a low kick. Heath comes in throwing bombs. He takes it down. He's got the. He's, he's got his really back. Good. He's got his hooks he's going in. For the choke. He's for the choke. Oh, it doesn't look good for Willie Peters. Big Heath Herring on his back, working the choke. He's Willie Peters is already in trouble. He's got the head up. It doesn't look good, boss. No, nope, it doesn't look good at all. He's pulling his head up. His chin, he's using his other hand. Good strategy, by the way. And it's working. He's, doing his chin. he's got the forearm. Right he could choke him out right now with the forearm. Yep. All he has to do is press that shoulder straight down. Peters is in trouble. He, he, he's in a no-win situation. He, he should tuck and roll or do something, but it's really hard with a big man like that on your back. And he taps oh, it out! Uh, fast fight. Quick fight. Very good looking, man. Good striking. 
Nice takedown and the finish hold. Perfect. You know, our heart goes out to Willie Peters for taking the fight on short notice, but Heath Herring looked tough. He did what he had to do. Went in there, threw the front kick, threw a couple punches. Uh, Willie tried to jump over the top. Was a little bit outgunned. Went to the bottom, unfortunately, on his stomach. And then Will, uh, Heath Herring took his back and just sunk the choke. Yep. There he is with his manager, Ronnie Nyquist. Ronnie Nyquist told me that Heath Herring is making such progress with his uh, trainer there, friction with him, four hammers in uh, Thai boxing, that they predict in two years he will be able to fight in the K-1. Oh, yeah, for sure, man. This guy right here, in. big right hand misses by Heath Herring. He comes storming Ooh. in, another left hand. Willie ducks down, tries to go for a single leg. He spins out, and he gets him crunched down into a side mount. Then there it is, the choke, and he taps out. Heath Herring, the big man, on, on his back. Tremendous quick win. Welcome to Pride, Mr. Heath Herring. Very impressive victory.